Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to connect your PlayStation 5 to your gaming monitor. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So newer monitors, it's very simple to go ahead and connect your PlayStation 5 up to it with no adapters whatsoever. And some of the huge benefits of using a monitor over a normal TV is the amount of input lag you have, the time it takes for a signal to travel from your inputs on your controller to the monitor itself. On some of these gaming monitors, it can be down to one millisecond. And this will be a lightning fast response time, something you won't notice whatsoever. As opposed to some of these TVs that you're playing on that could have hundreds of milliseconds for the delay. So it's very simple to connect your PlayStation 5 to your gaming monitor or just your monitor. All it will take is an HDMI cable just like this. Now, the thing that's kind of tricky actually is that most monitors don't come with speakers. So what you have to do is actually play with your headset just like this and use your headset all the time. Otherwise, connect some speakers. So I have some PC speakers right here that I can easily connect to my monitor. Now, HDMI carries an audio signal to it. So if you can connect it to a monitor like this, most monitors have some sort of audio option where you can take that 3.5 millimeter cable that comes with your speakers or your sound bar and plug it directly into the monitor. So let's connect everything right now and I'll show you what I mean. So first off, I'm gonna grab the 3.5 millimeter cable from my speakers from a computer and plug it into the back of my monitor. So right here is a 3.5 millimeter audio out slot on my monitor. I'm gonna go ahead and plug my PC speakers audio jack right into that slot. And when I do this, I will get audio into my PC speakers now. Now I will have multiple different HDMI slots. I can easily plug my HDMI cable in from my PS5. All right, so that's plugged in now. Okay, now let's go ahead and switch the input over to my PlayStation. And my PlayStation 5 is now on. Let's go ahead and connect my controller and start up a game. Now I have my speakers over here. I'm gonna increase the volume. So I have the Elder Scrolls Online in the background, and I'm controlling the volume with my PC speakers on my monitor. So this is very easy to do. If this video did indeed help you guys out, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation 5 tech out videos coming up next on Your6 Studios.